Right then, welcome back. Uh, today, we're going to track guide. We've not done one for a while. Many, 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 many weeks, months have passed since we've done one of these. Uh, we're at Imola. Uh, Varianta Bassa. Uh, bottom chicane. Yeah, sounds a bit in Italian. Um, first couple of corners, the uh, Tamburello chicane kind of thing. Very difficult, very bumpy, very nasty. Um, the hairpin, Tozer, turn seven, bumpy, nasty, massive kerb on the inside, can cause all sorts of carnies. Then we go up the hill, over the brow to the right, then we're going to get on the brakes, and then we've got to hit the double kind of left hander, Piratella, nightmare, Aqua Minerale, nightmare, because we're on the brakes, we cranked over, then we stamped it up, then we're on the brakes, and then we cranked over, and then we're firing up the hill, and you've got to avoid the kerbs, and then we're up to Varianta Alta. Yeah, top chicane, curbs, nasty, slow in, sliding, then downhill. This corner's disgustingly hard. Uh, turn 13, very, very nasty. That bad, they didn't even give it a name. And then you're into Revatsa 1 and Revatsa 2. Um, again, high curbs, bumpy. And then just the little cherry on top of the cake is Varianta Bassa, the bottom, bottom, bottom chicane. Yes, all in all, a hard lap. It's a hard lap to do clean laps as well i mean 50 percent of them are dirty and i don't mean they like doing things they shouldn't by themselves in darkened rooms i mean that they are foul laps uh you've got to get the chicane right before you start your lap so stay as far across to the right as you can don't turn until almost the end of the curb and you can abuse in a good way the first part of the chicane the first part of our intabacity loads and loads of curb and that should allow you a decent run onto the start finish straight so a quick lap starts before the lap you're on has ended if that makes sense uh, down towards the first couple of corners 200 meter board stay as far across to the right as you can get on the brakes just after that 200 meter board stay right and we want to try and straight line this as much as we can don't hit the curbs go a bit closer than i did there like that but don't hit the curbs otherwise you'll be off wait for the bumps to finish before you get fully on the gas as you fire down the road to the next left right flip flop chicane braking zone just after the curb on the right side the orange barrier carry loads of speed in and then drop down another gear just between the two corners stay as far across the left as you can and we're going to hook round the right hander get on the gas you can use a little bit of curve if you want use it like a berm that's not too bad and then the service road on the right hand side that's your breaking point for the tozer hairpin again run it in kind of hot use the slope and the camber to your advantage first second gear sometimes on the thousand cc bikes i'll see you right up the hill swing across to the left nip the corner off over the brow on the right and then the 100 meter board there or thereabouts on faster bikes it'll be early i appreciate that you may get the back wheel flying into the air again tight on the first apex run it out wide to the right tight on the second apex go back across to the left look for the track lights the 100 meter board somewhere between now and the 50 meter board you're going to get on the brakes sling it in third gear down another gear before you get to turn 10 and then up the hill it's this there's a lot to do you're on the front brake you're turning using the rear brake and as you come up the hill stay left look for the 100 meter board stay left as well on the brakes don't try and aim towards the apex of the corner stay left as far as you can run it through quick take curb on the second part you will get away with it it won't give you a foul lap but it's one of them where you've got to run it in stay left and then run it in fast run over the curb on the second part of the chicane back across to the left hand side of the track and this corner this is this is that i hate this corner it's disgusting avoid the curb try to apex as you go underneath the bridge just like nip the corner and get hard on the brakes you've got to stand the bike up and increase the brake pressure at the same time then you're going to run through use the curb on the outside as a berm don't hit the curbs on the inside they will fire you off and then we just got one more problem which is very antibassa look for the 200 meter board again we're going to try and straight line it as much as we can to the end of that curb on the right hand side brakes 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 wait for your turning point as we said at the start of the lap roll it in jump over the first bit of the curb nip the second bit of the curb nice and tight get on the gas if the bikes are a bit more powerful they can spin and slide so consider using traction control one and then across the line it is a hard lap one of the harder proper circuits in the game um, if you do it right if and this is a big if because it takes a long time if you get it right it should look a little something like this
And there we go. A 147.841. Um, it puts us uh, in third place on the leaderboards. It was a while ago. Uh, a good few months ago that we did this. I went back and checked uh, last night and we're still third. Uh, the times haven't really changed, so there's not a lot of movement on leaderboards. I think everyone's holding the breath for Ride 5, which we have pre-ordered. It's done. I've ordered the big full edition. My wife went mental. 90 quid? Yes, dear, 90 pounds for a video game. You're 40-odd years old. Yes, I know. Sorry. But oh well. Such is our curse. Um, R7 wheelies well. I know I've put this out before, but I'm mildly amused by it. Especially this bit down here through Variant Abasa. But I'll leave you there. Um, I'll start doing the track guides again and finish off all the tracks that we haven't really done and mentioned. Because I'm going to be doing a lot more races and we're going to try and do commentary on the races as well and bits and bobs. So if you want to see a bike or a setup for a bike or you want to see a track guide for something. I am not doing Macau. I'm not doing the Northwest 200. And I'm not doing the Isle of Man Manx Grand Prix and all that I'm not doing them I hate the road circuits they are disgusting I am not doing them so I'm sorry but no the line is somewhere and the line is there but thanks for watching commenting liking subscribing all the usual jazz and fingers crossed I'll see you next time take care stay safe peace